Hey everyone, once again welcome back to Pamely, and again welcome back to the Tired Corpse. We've only got these few endings, let's see if we can get a few more. Right, so there's a few things that I want to try out, a few of my own ideas, there's a few comments that I read, a few endings that I know exist that could be interesting as well, so I want to see if I can hit them up. Um, so, yeah, first of all, I suppose I want to use the phone and dial 6666, and then put in Reg Mistis, or Reg Mistis. Let's see what happens. Maybe I can do it without even burying the body. Because you do have the phone right at the very beginning, don't you? So yeah, let's try that. Okay, yeah, forget about the text messages. I should be able to dial numbers here. Yep, yeah, okay. So... 6666. Let's see if anyone picks up. No, you don't, Chechep. -che. Ooh. Right. Okay, so start the destination number. Yep, so there we go. Okay, so this is where we go. R E G. Do I put in the space with a zero or not? I guess I do. Because it was two words, right? So, yeah. There you go. I S T I S and then you finish it off with this, right? Did I leave the voicemail? I'm not sure to be perfectly honest with you. <laughs> uh okay, um that didn't seem to go all that well. There is a number that I do want to call, though, and it's the emergency number, apparently. It's 110. So... Come on. Someone pick up. It's an emergency! Oh! <laughs> Well, yeah, you haven't seen it yet, so you kind of are. <laughs> oh? Is that it? Is it over already? Emerg <laughs> emergency call. Chechep cannot take the pressure anymore and decides to find help from the local authority. At least, he feels safe and sound. Nothing can hurt him now. Or can it? One thing that Chechep may not understand. His mistake will always follow, no matter how much he tries to make himself safe. <laughs> right, okay, continue. I guess I was pretty respectful, right? Yeah, very respectful, because I didn't do anything apart from mess with the phone. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so, uh, what number's that? 15? Yeah, number 15. Okay, sure. Let's dive back in and... Ooh, what do I want to do? Maybe take a bath and then look at the window? Apparently that's something pretty interesting. Um, there's a, a sacred grave in the northeast part of the cemetery that I haven't been to yet. Apparently that's a thing. Um, of course, I want to dig up all the graves and find all the bodies I possibly can. And of course, I want to go as disrespectful as possible. Steal everything, insult everything, dig up everything, water and clean nothing. But maybe I'll save that till the end. Yeah, there's a, there's a few things I want to do before the video's over. This might be like the last video of the Tide Corpse, honestly. I think, um, so far, I prefer the first one for the scares. This one might be slightly more interesting, though, from, like, a cultural perspective. Right, so... Let's just bury hastily. Yeah. Let's finish that process really quick. And, um, then I guess I'll grab a shovel and head for the northeast. Uh, shall I take everything with me just in case? I mean, I guess I could, right? So take the cleaning tools, take the flower basket. I'll grab the shovel, of course. Maybe the watering can. Because maybe I don't need to water graves. Maybe I need to water flowers for some weird ending or something. I don't know. I might stumble into something like that. The shovel, I think, should be down there. Yep, that never moves. And I don't think the watering can does either. Maybe I should take that bath now. 
I don't know if we need to do this in the evening or at night, but apparently, yeah, I, I guess I missed it when I last took a bath. But if you take a bath, then look up at the window. Maybe someone's, like, perving? <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, that window right there. Can, yeah, can people peep? Well, let's find out. Okay. Close the door. Nah, I want people to watch. Take a bath. I know this is insulting, but hopefully it's going to be worth it. Right. Oh, shit! Hey! <laughs> okay. Yeah, that was pretty good. You... Oh. Am I actually dead? Was that an ending? Oh, wow. Okay. Right. Uh, felt like I was double teamed or something. Anything else? You want to hit the trifecta? <laughs> oh boy, right, can we get in this one now? Nah, I don't know if we can ever get in that one, but yeah, okay, that was pretty cool. It wasn't an ending though. Right, yes, uh, I got all the tools. Let's, um... Oh, maybe let's have a look at the well. Apparently if we keep looking down the well or trying to interact with the well, we can like try and hide in it or something. I could interact with this before, right? Yeah, draw water. Do you have to do that first? He says it's, like, too heavy or something, right? Oh, this isn't the time. Yeah, is it supposed to be this heavy? I don't know, is it? I wonder if I thought... Scary old well. Yeah, it must be haunted. Maybe there's a specific place you need to click on to, like, jump in or something. All I can do is look at the moment. Do we, like, <laughs> use this to abseil down, or...? Okay, well, I don't know. Maybe I'm missing something. Let's go find this sacred grave. Can we get through here at all? I uh, don't know if we can. Still, yeah, let's use this time to explore. So where else we got? A mattress. Look, yeah, why was it dumped here? Okay, there is actually a way through, it looks like. And that goes to the river section. Uh-huh. Right, so we got a few boulders. Didn't I see, like, um, I saw, like, a Polaroid photo around here. There it is. Whose photo is this? What, what's it of? Uh, it says, what's that? Java, July 2003. And that's it. Well, I don't know. Got a cage here as well. Bird cage. Right, do not litter. Hmm. I still feel there's something up with that swing as well. Yeah, I think this is where evil spirits, or spirits at the very least, congregate. So maybe I'm pissing them off with the swing. Got some pants here. <laughs> Aren't you doing something kind of similar? Oh, I suppose that's just outside, right? Ah, oh, there's another photo! This one says, it's everywhere. It must be something. January 2004 this time. And I think, it's hard to see on the video, I'm sure, but there's I think there's maybe a pachong in the doorway there. Let's keep this going. Are we going to find some more? Okay, well, I'm kind of in the northeast right now, so I think the sacred grave is meant to be around here somewhere. Really, though, I found two photos. I want to find a third. But I might be here for a while. Flowers, yeah, forget those flowers. Unless it's named, I'm not bothered. There we go, Kananga flower. Nice. Okay, got some floating stuff over here. Right. Yeah, and what's up with the message that I get through the radio? Let's turn it on. Can, oh. Can I not turn it on? Maybe it just turns on when you don't want it to or something? Hmm. I don't want to insult everything. <laughs> Not yet. There will be time for that. Uh, the talisman as well. Right. Okay. Oh, there's a gap in the wall. Maybe this is it. Through here? Right. Or maybe this is like an old part of the cemetery or something. Hmm. 
I guess I'm looking for a headstone or something like that to signify that there's a grave. I'm not entirely sure why it's sacred. It's just, uh, that's what the comment said. <laughs> oh, well, there's something. Okay, there's an offering, a symbol and an offering. A symbol which I can't see, but uh, apparently people say the symbol... Wait, what? It's got something to do with a cult. All right. Now, I did pick up the lighter, but I, oh, I can't light the candles, unfortunately. Still, okay. Well, that's interesting. Not what I'm looking for, though. Can we just go on through this? Oh, okay. Oh, grave. Here we are. Ah, this could be the sacred grave. So... <laughs> okay. Oh, what was that? Sleep! Shall I? Well, if I'm gonna sleep, let's sleep in a, in a dugout grave. <laughs> there we are. Nothing inside it, apart from me. <laughs> yeah, that looks comfy. Oh. Am I being buried? Buried alive! A grave is like a final resting place. If someone's lying inside when the time hasn't come yet, it's considered very inappropriate. Chechip does the act, and now he gets the consequence. Oh, brilliant. Okay. Just hope that someone finds this out as soon as possible before he runs out of oxygen. Well, it's an ending, so uh, he probably doesn't get found. Okay, that was pretty cool. All right. Taking a late night bath and digging up a grave. But apart from that, pretty good. All right. Uh, so there's that. What else? Right, maybe I should start digging up some more graves, actually. Just out of interest, though, what was the number? Oh, 28, right. Uh, I don't know if there's, like, the same amount of endings in this one as there was in the first one. What did we get in the first one? Right, there's 35 at the very least in the first one. So maybe there's 35 in this one, too. Okay, right. Now, for this one, I might not want to bury hastily. I'm going to go through the process properly, untie the knots, gently put him into his final resting place, and then maybe I want to do some work. I don't know if I'm going to get another like good ending out of this, but we'll see. Okay, so I'm doing this properly again because there's a book in the gravekeeper's house, and if you look on the back of it, it mentions, like, an extra little bit to this procedure with, um, beans. And I remember seeing some beans in the mosque area, or not the mosque, really, it was the, uh, the storage room area. And I couldn't do anything with it, but maybe if I have a look at the book, then the beans, maybe there's, like, another option. Anyway, I think he's ready to go, so place the body inside and board him up. Right, so I'll take the key, I'll take the to-do list, because I think I actually might want to do it this time. Take the flashlight. Right, it was one of these two books. I don't know if it was the death log. No, no. But let's have a look inside. Right, so we got some phone numbers. Quite a lot of phone numbers, actually. And I'm wondering if maybe one of them is going to give me a good ending. Maybe I'll come back to that if I run out of other ideas. But I think it's this book over here. And that's how to take care of a corpse. That's it, yeah. And on the back... It says, don't forget to take some beans and plant them on the new gravel. Uh, make sure the beans are dried out and cannot grow into a plant, so that they can't be alive again. So that they get tricked into thinking that they should wait... That... Wait, wait the bean to grow, yeah, wait for the bean to grow, uh, before they can go back to the living world. Right, okay. Apparently this is important, so, yeah. That's something I didn't do for Brave and Hard Working, so maybe this extra little bit is going to give me a, a slightly different ending? I don't know. Just like the tools, I think the key is always on the windowsill. 
kuburannya teh harus saya urus. Yeah, and it is again. Let's just turn the flashlight on. Right, so I need to need to go in, don't I? To get the other key. The storage room key, that's it. Let's close the door. Somewhat respectful. That got dark quick, what the fuck? <laughs> that was odd. Right, I think these are the beans. Yeah, mung beans. Ah, take some! Yes! There you go, alright. Uh, right, yeah, again, just... Don't want to be too disrespectful. Now I think I just want to get on with my tasks. And when we do get to the grave, I'll plant some beans on it. Okay, so everything's done, I can rest now. But it's not. It's really not. Because I want to get back over to the grave. And I want to plant those beans. So, yeah, let's just go all this way. And then I suppose I'll rest. In my bed, not in a grave, because I don't want to get buried alive. Uh, over here, that's right. Wait, were they flowers? Yeah, pick up some more flowers, why not? Uh, there we go. Right, so... Ah, yeah, plant the beans! But it said keep them dry, right? So I, I don't want to water it. Oh, I can't. Good. Okay, good. A um, little bit more tuberos. And now we go to sleep until later on, I guess. Oh, bloody hell. I've had so many messages. What the fuck do you want, honestly? Don't procrastinate. Oh, don't fucking look at your phone. Here we are then, it's night, so this is where we do our night patrol and check out that everything's okay. Yeah? Hmm. No noises, so that's, that's always good. Okay, yeah, I think we're pretty much ready to go. Wow, it's really a lot darker than it was before. So, the same sort of areas, I suppose. Do we light the torches? Let's not light the torches. Hello. Oh, mm, boy. Right, so, is everything okay around here? It should be. The well, look. Again, yeah, I don't know where you get this option to, like, climb down the well. If anyone could explain that to me, that would be much appreciated. Fee box, that's right. There was this advertisement. What, what is this, anyway? Uh, okay. Solutions for those who want to be rich. Find Oh, find a sacred grave. Take a handful of grave soil. Rub. What the fuck? This is a step to see ghosts. Oh, no. I, I, I don't want to do that now. I'm trying to be respectful. But maybe next time? Don't procrastinate the key. That's right. What's this about? To take the tools. So he didn't mention the wells this time. Okay. Well, I did it anyway. Let's sleep. And let's see what we're rewarded with. Not a nightmare. Certainly not a nightmare. Hey there. No. Oh. Right. Let's leave the door open, just in case. End the day. Keep expecting to see something. Just poke its head around the corner. Oh, not brave and hardworking again. <sighs> What's that shit with the mung beans, then? Do we have to do something else or get the fuck out after that, or...? I don't know. Damn, that's a shame, because that's, you know, it's a lot of time devoted to just getting the same ending there. That's a bugger. Yeah, I was respectful. I was brave and hardworking. Oh, well, I'll go back in and, I don't know, dig up all the graves. <laughs> no, 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 I don't actually want to do that. I want to have a look at that advertisement again, and I want to follow the procedure to, uh, to see ghosts. That sounds interesting. Right, I don't know if we're going to need this, but um, if we're doing a little bit of digging to get some soil, perhaps we will need the shovel. Right, next up, let's go to the toilets, have a look at that advertisement, then follow the steps. I want to see some ghosts. That's what this has kind of been lacking, this chapter. Ghosts. It's, it's lost the fear element for the most part. The first one was full of it. Right, so, still in the same spot? Yes, indeed. Okay, inspect. What do I want to get rich? Okay, maybe I can get rich as well. There's three flowers, jasmine, tuberose, kananga. Yep, Chris. Chicken feet. 
a comb of bananas, glass of black coffee. Again, it's all to do with this sacred grave. That does sound kind of interesting, actually. But first, right. Yeah, find the sacred grave, take a handful of grave soil, rub your eyes with the soil. <laughs> Simple! Okay. Back over to the northeast. Right, here we are again. Rub your eyes with grave soil, that's it! I don't know. Oh, we're here. And I can barely move. <laughs> oh, hey! Right, I think it's working. <laughs> um, hello. How's it going? Hey, oh dear. <laughs> um, I'm trying to hop away, believe it or not. Oh, jeez. Can see it all, okay. Wanting to know more beyond our ability is not always wise. Sometimes the knowledge is purposefully hidden because we are not strong enough to receive them. Chechep regrets his decision. Now he cannot feel alone because he can see everything. From human to the spirits, from ghouls to giants. He hates it, but what can he do? He cannot undo the ritual. He must live now, knowing that they watch each of his moves. Lucky him. Well, that was kind of cool. Wasn't terribly scary, but yeah, that's the sort of ending I'm after. And I was respectful enough. <laughs> okay, so what number was that? Uh, 19? Can see it all, there you are. Okay, let's dive back in. Yeah, I, I, I want to try that get-rich-quick scheme. If only I could find some bananas. I think I know where the rest of it is. Uh, I also want to um, dig up the guy I hastily bury and then just leave him out, you know, rather than reburying him like I did before. Just to see what happens. Maybe I'll do that next. All the while searching for bananas. <laughs> Go on then. Just running along all the graves, because why not? I'm being disrespectful this time. And I don't care who knows it. <laughs> there we go. Right. So then, here we are. Dig, 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 dig. Perfect. Right, down, just to remove all the boards. And let's roll him out, like he's a fucking transformer. There we are. Pull the corpse out. And that's where I'm going to leave him. I don't... I don't know if I should just go to sleep now or what. <laughs> Did that jump go wrong? Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> uh... Oh. Oh. Okay. Unfinished business. Leaving without finishing the ritual is definitely not a wise thing to do. Mysteriously, one of Chechep's feet is grabbed by a mysterious hand when he's about to go out from the grave. As if the corpse lying inside does not want Chechep to leave just like that. <laughs> Let's just hope that Chechep's alright after the sudden shock he gets from this. Wow, okay. Again, kind of short and sweet. Right, what number's that? I was really hoping to, uh, to have a look around and see if I can find some bananas. I really want to see if I can get rich quick now. 23? Yes, yeah, 23. Okay. Once again, we're going back in. Yeah, that's coffee. Which I can probably use if I know what it's used for. If I go look at the advertisement, the right side of it. <sighs> I just gotta find some bananas. And know where the rest of it is. That's such a bugger. God, they could be anywhere. They really could be anywhere. White, hang on, white champaka. I can't find it anywhere else, apparently. I'll pick it up. Right. I'm kind of stuck on the wall here. And I'm, I'm... Okay, what the fuck? What? What just happened? Whoa! What the hell was that? Was it because I picked up that special flower? Damn. What the hell? D disrespectful thief! 
Taking someone else's favourite thing is not a wise thing to do, especially when it's done without permission. Picking the djinn's favourite flower is certainly a blunder. I didn't know that! Well, I guess now I paid the price. And I still haven't found the fucking bananas. Right, I've got to go back in to find these damn bananas. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, it's a sacred flower. I didn't know that. There was probably some sort of clue, a book I didn't read, but... Shit. Ah, uh, 12 or 13? Yeah, 13. Damn. <laughs> We're collecting the endings, just not the ones I want. Alright, open the document once again. We still haven't dug up all the graves. Maybe I should do that and collect bananas. Yeah. That's it. That's a good excuse to explore the entirety of the cemetery. Dig up all the graves. And hopefully find some bananas along the way. Okay, right, where do I start? Because, uh, this place is actually kind of big. <laughs> There's probably a hundred or so graves here? <sighs> right, well, um... Might as well start here, I guess. Yeah. Uh, I, I suspect quite a lot of this is just gonna be a lot of nothing, a lot of digging for no reason. I suppose, if I find anything, I'll, uh, I'll leave that bit in. But otherwise, I'll probably just edit around it. What are you talking about? I'm taking care of it. By making sure that there's going to be no bodies in it. Ooh, hang on. A doll. Throw it away. There we go. We're having a massive clear out. That's what we're doing. Oh, okay. What's this? Cloth. Again. Throw it away. Don't need it. Don't want it. Okay. Did I do that one? No, I did not. That one's already been cleared out. Nice. <laughs> Oh dear. Um, I take it the ending for this one isn't going to be very good. And I suppose I should try and walk along the graves as well, just to disrespect them even more. <laughs> Alright, we've got some more over here. Okay, oh, we actually have some remains here. Uh, look at them. So scary. The shroud with the bones only. Yeah, we don't need them. See ya. <laughs> Man. This cannot end well. Oh, I've seen this a few times now. Some garlic. Right. Throw it away! Throw it away. Yeah. <laughs> uh, is there some sort of, like, vampire ending or something? Let's hope so. You, you need a shovel to dig this? You've got a shovel. You haven't been using your hands for all this, have you? What about this one? Oh, that doesn't work either. What the fuck? Did I bug the game? Oh no! Right. I guess it's like a child's grave, right? Okay, well, maybe I'll just have to leave these two and dig up the rest. Oh, hang on. Almost missed that. Some coins. Don't need them. <laughs> well, actually, maybe I would need them. I don't know why I threw them away. It probably would have been better if I kept hold of them, but oh well. <laughs> there we go. We're probably like a third done. Yeah, I've been doing quite a lot of digging. I think my arms are getting kind of tired. My finger certainly is. It's a lot... A lot of clicking. Ah, oh, this was in the first one too, a jenglet. Right. Uh, probably don't want to do this, but I definitely want to do this. Hmm. Okay. Keep it going. <laughs> right. I suppose when I dig up the, the body that I just buried hastily... I, uh, I don't want to fall down and then jump back out, because that might sort of ruin the ending that I'm going for. If this is indeed a different ending. I really hope it is. It's been this weird sort of background noise, just building, ever since I started digging up graves that I wasn't meant to. It just got a little louder. I guess we're onto something with this. Is this the one with it? Right, yeah, there's some hair. I've dug pretty deep, I think it's enough. Oh, is this one of the ones that I was actually meant to do? Uh, H. Yeah, it was. <laughs> I didn't really mean to do my job. Throw away the hair. Right. That's right. Yeah, I think we're... We're going down a path where something's going to happen. What's this? Remember, don't procrastinate. Oh, I'm not. What's this? An offering? 
Did a ritual happen? Let's say that. The jug. Uh, some people prefer this. Offering water container. Yeah, either way. Throw it away. That's it. And just keep on digging. <laughs> oh, what's that? A, a knife? There's a knife in this one? Alright, that's different. Let's look at it first. A bloody knife. Why is it here? I'm getting scared. Oh, throw it away. Okay, yeah, don't want to fall down this one. You hear that? The sound, the, the music in the background changing? The more I dig, the, the louder and the more high-pitched it gets. Oh, what's this, a shroud? Toss it away. Fuck shrouds. Is there something down there? Oh, yep, yeah, the doll. Throw that away. It's going to be as good as new when this place is opened again. What do you want? Don't... Don't call me too often, chap. I'm busy. If you want to call, make sure it's urgent. I haven't been calling you. Has someone been calling you? Pretending to be me? I don't know. Interesting. This is actually kind of... Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, damn, I found some... I found some buried treasure! Okay. A Chris? Oh, another one. Alright. Hmm. People, why? Toss it away. Cool. I have been very insulting, haven't I? What is it now? Chet, you're now working in a grave, right? Don't speak rudely there. How do you know that I've been speaking rudely? <laughs> Are you listening to me? God damn. Oh. Some more remains? Throw them away. Man. <laughs> I've checked this area and it's fine. No, it's not fine. It's far from fine. I am kind of wondering how I'm going to play this if I actually do survive to get to the bed or, or get to the gate. Probably, I, I guess I'm just going to go to sleep. Yeah, I'm going to go to sleep and see what happens. I'll leave the door open as well, just in case anyone wants to come in. Oh, bloody hell, another one? Okay, we're getting some new ones. My friend... Okay, my friends were digging graves randomly and suddenly he got a large amount of wealth. Try it, Chep. It's also a convenience that you're the gravekeeper. Right. Okay, there you go. There's the excuse I was looking for. Wow, I'm Mr. Popular tonight. Please... Oh, please untie my knots, I beg you. Ah, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Shit! Alright, the dead are communicating. And they won't shut the fuck up. Where's my child? I died for him. My son. Shit. Alright. This is certainly leading to spookiness, but I haven't got that ending yet. Still more digging to be done. Oh, what? The, dig the digging's finished. No, it's not. Jerry can. Uh, oh, drum on it. <laughs> And some cloth? Oh, right. Is that bloodied? Yeah. Throw it away. Do some more drumming. And then throw it away. There you go. Speaking of which, I think there's actually a drum just outside the mosque. Need to drum on that as well. Here we are. Oh. Is this an ending? Okay, well, I guess the drum beat was good, so the mosque area is absolutely fine. Uh, shall I take the key? Nah, fuck it. The guy probably wants me to take the key, right? He probably wants me to check the wells as well. Not gonna do it. Ain't gonna happen. Okay, so I, I think at this point I've just gotta go check that everything's been dug up. <gasps> and I've missed a few! Oh, what's this? Garbage? Ah, uh, let's see. Will I become a sinner? Well, if there's anything I've learned from this game is that you can't really win. No matter what you do, you're insulting someone. Oh! Maybe this is the third photo that I was trying to find. Uh, or maybe not. Hmm, okay. Throw it away. Yeah. Okay, alright. 
Now am I done? I mean, aside from the sacred grave. Am I done? Have I... Have I uncovered all of them? I think I probably have. Haven't, sorry. I have now. <laughs> Hopefully. Here it is then. Dig, 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 dig. Don't sleep. Definitely don't sleep. Oh yeah, the talisman. Can I throw that away now? Might as well. <laughs> what do you want? Please help him to find Lilith. Also, please call her too. Yeah, okay. Well, maybe the number's in the book. If there was a snag. Any leftover? Look at the ashtray. Makes me want to smoke. So dirty, disgusting. Apparently it's Deadens or Deedens. I can't drink things like this, no. Burn some trash, that's it. You've got it. Let's push the swing around a little bit. What the hell is this? An amulet? Huh, why is it here? Dunno, throw it away. Shit, alright. Pile, pile of leaves? Oh, okay. Weird. <sighs> Steal the money? Steal the money. Do everything. Just seriously, do everything. You don't have the key? Wait, you don't have- what? There's a key to this? Oh, no. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> I didn't realize you could do that. Take a bath, because why not? But this time I'm not going to look up. I think the spirits are already angered enough, to be honest. Squat toilet, it's dirty already, that's right. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> nice fucking head. Oh, nah, it's okay. It's okay, this isn't going to end it here, is it? No. By the way, still haven't found the bananas. <laughs> I don't know where they're hiding away. Ah, oh, man. Okay. Sneak through. Yeah, crawl through the gap. That's right. Okay. I'm pretty sure I've uncovered every single grave. So I think it's time to sleep and live with the consequences. Or die with the consequences. I think that's more likely, to be honest. Um, anything else insulting I can do in here? I suppose... Right, what's this? Yeah, like, dust the room. That's right, I'm not meant to do that at this time. Something about the mirror, right? Say it's so blurred. Okay, there's a, there's a broom over here. Sweep the floor, sweep the floor, that's it. Okay, what's this? Uh, maybe, I don't know. When will I get a good one? Yeah, just loads of complaining. Turn the TV on, get the nails. Too many for my need. Throw away. You, you took a loan for a bucket? <laughs> I mean, that's, that's unfortunate if that is actually the case. Can't do anything with the chicken feet apart from look. Bottle kerosene? Smells bad, yeah. What's this? The sewing kit? Sew some cloth, why not? <laughs> oh boy. I think I've pretty much done everything insulting, apart from like maybe go in the mosque or something. You'd think that'd be enough, right? Let's see. Sleep. Yes. Aduh, suara apa itu? Rasanya saya aja mungkin ya. I don't think it is. Oh, it's on the fucking roof. Ouch! That looked weird as hell, but that was a scary ending. Ah, oh, destroyer of peace. I love it. No one would be at peace when their resting place is getting destroyed with no apparent reason. Chechep's wrongdoings and hasty actions in redigging the graves of innocent people make the consequences get even bigger. Now Chechep will not only 
uh, will not be at peace in his life as a payback for destroying others. Maybe Chechet would now understand not to disturb people, even if they're dead already. Okay. That was a lot of work that went into that one, but destroyer of peace and look at all this shit. Wow. <laughs> I pretty much did everything wrong. Okay. Right. Now, I think that's probably going to wrap the video up, and maybe that's going to wrap the chapter up, really. Let's see. What number was that? Uh, 17? Destroyer of Peace. That's a good one. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much for watching this sixth video of Pamela. I have a feeling that this might be the last time you see the Tide Corpse on my channel. Uh, I guess I'll come back to this when the third chapter is released, all right? See you then. Come on, someone pick up. It's an emergency! Oh shit, hey! <laughs> okay. Yeah, that was pretty good. You. Oh! <laughs> there we are. Nothing inside it, apart from me. Somewhat respectful. That got dark quick, what the fuck? Hello. <laughs> are you guarding my door? <laughs> I'm starting to see more of them. But uh, the strange thing is, I've done all the right things. Why are you haunting me? Come on. Give me a break. Keep expecting to see something just poke its head around the corner. Oh, not brave and hardworking again. Right, I think it's working. <laughs> um, hello. I don't know if I should just go to sleep now or what. <laughs> Did that jump go wrong? Picking the gin's favourite flower is certainly a blunder. I didn't know that! You need a shovel to dig this? You've got a shovel. You haven't been using your hands for all this, have you? I think my arms are getting kind of tired. My finger certainly is. It's a lot... A lot of clicking. You hear that? Don't call me too often, chap. I'm busy. If you want to call, make sure it's urgent. I haven't been calling you. Toss it away! I have been very insulting, haven't I? Please, oh, please untie my knots, I beg you. Ah, go fuck yourself. Will I become a sinner? Well, if there's anything I've learned from this game is that you can't really win, no matter what you do, you're insulting someone. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> nice fucking head. Oh, it's on the fucking roof. Ooh, that looked weird as hell, but that was a scary ending. Oh, Destroyer of Peace, I love it.